hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel in case you're wondering i am marilyn and if this is your first time you are welcome so this is the science nerd class i realize that i'm such a science nerd but anyways so yeah i'm sure you're here to find out more information about microbiology and physiology and what it's all about so because it's that time y'all so definitely keep watching to find out more information that i have for you so it's almost that time of the year where grade 12 students need to apply for a course or a degree so today i'm here to talk to you about what i'm studying which is microbiology and physiology guys it's at night i'm filming at night so you're gonna have to forgive me but and i look crusty af but more of the points more of the story is uh i'm here to feed out information that is important to somebody that might be considering to study a bsc degree in microbiology and physiology Okay, so what I've noticed is that um, with these kind of courses, you have to choose whether you want to do physiology, biochemistry, like you figure out which combo you want to do. So as for myself, I chose the combination of biological sciences. Guys, this whole thing is called biological sciences, just in case you're wondering, at my institution. So I don't know maybe differs with the different institution you go to but at my institution it's known as biological sciences so i think i need proper lighting oh the lighting is better here so um basically i'm just gonna sit down and tell you what is um information about the course that i'm doing i'm studying at the university of northwest so yeah push us from campus hey <laughs> so i'm gonna be telling you about microbiology and physiology and yeah okay so basically what is microbiology I my notes my sorry my eyes read um, microbiology is the study of microscopic organisms such as bacteria viruses and i need to sneeze <laughs> And many more okay so um if you like seeing small things that are there but not there then yeah microbiology is the thing for you if you love microscopes but um learning more about bacteria and viruses and all that stuff yeah then it's definitely for you so the physiology aspect of it physiology is the study of how the human body works i'm a curious cat i want to know how my body works that's why i chose this combination of microbiology and physiology so that's a really nice course um simple Woo, what the fuck did i just say it's it's a nice course it's interesting if you love science research practicals the lab and all that good shebang bang um i really love it guys i don't ha really have much more to say there are career opportunities you can um do um you can be a la laboratory technician research scientist food scientist mycologist parasitologist and you can do research on cosmetic products and if they are good for the skin so guys yeah i know I'm, i butchered some of the words but hey, 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 hey it's science so it's kind of hard to actually um pronounce the words so yeah that is the little bit of information that you need to know about microbiology and physiology uh if you have any questions or anything definitely comment down below and tell me um what information i should provide you next so that is my information about microbiology and physiology for all the students that are interested or looking into studying biological sciences specializing in this course uh it's really nice guys it's just that you need to put in the work um nothing comes easy don't think you're gonna run away from um physics you're not gonna run away from physics and chemistry it's always gonna be there so be prepared for that so i love you guys and i'll see you in my next video definitely leave a comment and tell me what information you would like to know love you and i'll see you in my next video bye 
Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can find out more information about microbiology and physiology and follow me on my journey until I graduate. <laughs> so, yeah, so definitely subscribe and keep up with me so you can know more information about what I do.